Ever thought about living in a city where the air is fresh, energy is green, and everyone enjoys a good quality of life? That's exactly what we're exploring today. Join us as we take a tour of the most innovative, eco-friendly cities shaping the future. These urban wonders are proving that sustainability and thriving communities can go hand in hand. Sustainable Cities, a tour of eco-friendly innovations. What makes a city truly sustainable? Before we get into the exciting examples, let's take a moment to understand what it means for a city to be sustainable. It's like a city where energy comes from renewable sources, like the sun and wind, where waste is minimized and even turned into something useful, and where transportation is efficient, reducing the need for cars and lowering pollution. Sounds like a dream, right? But this dream is becoming a reality in cities around the world. Sustainable cities prioritize the well-being of their residents without compromising the needs of future generations. They're not just about planting a few trees or setting up recycling bins. These cities are rethinking everything from how we build homes to how we get around, aiming to create inclusive, resilient communities that thrive in harmony with nature. Now, it's time to explore some sustainable cities, Copenhagen. Let's start our tour in Copenhagen, Denmark, a city that's often hailed as one of the greenest in the world. Now, if you think biking to work is just for fitness enthusiasts, Copenhagen will change your mind. This city has made cycling a way of life for its residents. With over 382 kilometers of cycle lanes, traffic lights designed for cyclists during rush hour, and bike bridges. The city aims to become carbon neutral by 2025, with half of all work commutes being made by bike, benefiting both the environment and health. The city clears snow from bike lanes before roads, ensuring that residents can continue cycling regardless of weather conditions. But it's not just about bikes. Copenhagen is also home to innovative recycling programs where you can return bottles for a small deposit, and the city's buses are going electric. There's even a waste-to-energy plant called Copenhill, which doubles as a recreational area with a rooftop ski slope and hiking trails. How's that for multitasking? Singapore. Next, we travel to Singapore, a city that's taken the idea of urban greenery to the next level, literally. If you've ever seen pictures of Singapore's iconic super trees, you'll know what I mean. These towering structures, standing between 25 and 50 meters tall, are more than just eye candy. They're vertical gardens that host over 200 species of plants, helping to absorb carbon dioxide and reduce the city's carbon footprint. But these super trees do more than just look pretty. They're equipped with solar panels that harvest energy and their canopies help regulate the temperature by absorbing heat. At night, they light up the city with a dazzling display, turning the urban jungle into a magical garden. And it doesn't stop there. Singapore has a national parks board that promotes green roofs and walls across the city, transforming even the most concrete of buildings into lush green spaces. The goal? To turn Singapore into a city in a garden where every new development includes plant life and the city's residents can enjoy nature even in the heart of the metropolis. Ljubljana. Our next stop is Ljubljana, the capital of Slovenia. Now you might not think of bees when you think of a city, but in Ljubljana, these little insects play a big role. The city is home to the Bee Path, a project that has turned Ljubljana into one of the most bee-friendly cities in the world. But why bees? Well, bees are crucial for biodiversity. They help pollinate plants, which is essential for food production. In Ljubljana, there are more than 4,500 beehives, and the city has created a movement around them. The bee path connects various locations across the city, educating people about the importance of bees and encouraging urban beekeeping. Ljubljana's commitment to green living doesn't stop with the bees. The city has been recognized as one of Europe's greenest capitals, boasting the highest percentage of green space per resident. With over 230 kilometers of cycle paths and a car-free city center, 
It's no wonder Ljubljana has become a model for sustainable urban living. Curitiba. Let's hop over to Curitiba, Brazil, where we find a city that's turned waste management into an art form. Curitiba is famous for its innovative waste programs that tackle environmental issues while also addressing social problems. One of the most notable initiatives is the Green Exchange Program, where residents of favelas can trade recyclable materials for food, bus tickets, and other essentials. This program doesn't just clean up the city, it provides valuable resources to those who need them most, while also supporting local farmers by purchasing their surplus crops. It's a win-win situation that has significantly reduced waste and improved the lives of many Curitiba residents. Curitiba's approach to sustainability extends to its public transportation system as well. The city's bus rapid transit system is a model of efficiency, offering quick, affordable, and eco-friendly transportation to 75% of the population. When it comes to preserving nature, Curitiba has created a green belt of parks that not only prevent flooding, but also provide a natural habitat for wildlife and recreational spaces for people. Amsterdam. Our final stop takes us to Amsterdam, a city famous for its canals and bicycles, but also for making waves in the fight against plastic pollution. Amsterdam has pioneered several innovative projects to keep its waterways clean, including the world's first bubble barrier, a device that uses a curtain of bubbles to collect plastic waste from the canals. But Amsterdam isn't just about high-tech solutions. The city is implementing a community-driven approach to sustainability, such as Plastic Whale, which organizes plastic fishing trips where volunteers collect plastic waste from canals, which is then recycled into office furniture and boats, promoting a fun and effective greener lifestyle. Amsterdam's commitment to sustainability doesn't stop with plastics. The city is also tackling food waste with initiatives like the Waste Transformer, which turns organic waste into green energy, compost, and fertilizer. And with its focus on circular economy practices, Amsterdam is setting a new standard for how cities can thrive while taking care of the planet. So, what do all these cities have in common? They're not just adapting to the challenges of today, they're planning for the future. And the best part? We can all be a part of this movement, whether it's by choosing to bike instead of driving, supporting local green initiatives, or simply being more mindful of our impact on the environment. We all have a role to play in creating sustainable cities. So, that's a wrap on our tour of eco-friendly innovations in sustainable cities. If you found this inspiring, hit that like button, drop a comment, share with others, and don't forget to subscribe to the Tech Insider for more tech-driven insights.